Good morning, everyone. It is Monday. It's a new week. It's May 1st. It's May, you guys. It is Mason's birthday month. That's nuts. It's gonna be a busy May. I think we have something planned every single weekend of May. So it's gonna be a busy month, including this week. It's gonna be a busy week for me. Um, also, Mason has three more full weeks of school and then finals. So, oh my gosh, summer is almost here. That's nuts. But all right, let's have some coffee. Like I said, it's gonna be a busy week. Let's have a good week. So tomorrow I get to get my hair cut. So if you guys have been following, my hair girl had to take a leave of absence. And tomorrow I finally get to get my hair cut. It's been months. So I'm definitely overdue. My hair's gotten so long. But with that being said, I wanna bring our flowers when I see her tomorrow. So I won't have time to run and do, I have to like wake up super early. So I think I'm just gonna go ahead and go today to get her flowers. Um, that way I'm not rushing in late to my appointment tomorrow. And with that being said, the best place I think to get flowers is Trader Joe's. Plus that also gives me an excuse to go back to Trader Joe's because I forgot to get my spicy and sweet jalapenos. So that's what I'm about ready to do. I'm ready to head out, head to Trader Joe's. I also need to get gas for the truck, which oh, I don't want. You guys, our gas is over $5 a gallon here in Arizona. Um, I am gonna go to Sam's Club. Hopefully it's still under $5 at Sam's Club. And the truck takes so much gas, so it's always like so sad to see the money just go away. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna grab gas, head to Trader Joe's, pick out some pretty flowers. Don't forget my uh, sweet and spicy jalapenos like I did last time. And probably pick up a few groceries while I'm, I'm there, but that's the plans. I told you it's gonna be a busy week, and part of it is I get my hair cut tomorrow, so. All right, off to Trader Joe's. All right, I just got back from Trader Joe's and look at the, I, last minute I decided not to get like a bouquet of flowers. I went with this instead. Isn't it so pretty? And then she'll have a pot to reuse if she wants to, but that's what I got her. Bring that to her. And then I also got, well, I got some new things from Trader Joe's, so let me pull everything out and I'll show you. All right, I didn't get a whole lot, just a small little haul here, but I also got, her kids, she has six kids, you guys. Um, so I'm gonna bring her a thing of cookies so her kids can all have, and these things are amazing. Last time I was there, they were sampling them. We devoured them, so I had to pick one up for the Bevos too. <laughs> so that's what I'm gonna bring to summer. This is new. This looks good. I don't even know if I like a lote. I don't even know if I've ever had a lote, but I got the salad. Picked up some sour cream. I picked up some cream cheese. So I've been doing more protein in the morning. I've been trying to do like a piece of toast. Um, I got the Ezekiel toast last time. It's a different flavor, but it was yum. So I'm gonna continue to do that. So I put it, I toast this up, put an egg, put a little bit of cream cheese, and then that's my breakfast. And I've been enjoying that. What it, I got Mason, his, he loves bean and cheese, black bean burritos, he loves those. I always pick one up. And then I went with ham this time and pepperoni. The best sweet potato fries. These are so good in the air fryer. I also picked these up. They're a lot of times out of stock, but they had plenty of them today, so I just grabbed them since I saw them. Are those not the cutest little cucumbers? So I had to get those. I grabbed another head of lettuce. They've got the cheap bananas. Love the refried beans, always grab a can when I'm there. Mason for his school lunches, he loves Hawaiian rolls and this is just Trader Joe's brand of Hawaiian rolls, they're good. Picked up these finally, I've seen them, I don't know if I'm gonna like them. I've been loving the everything bagel seasoning lately. In fact, I picked up an avocado to do avocado toast and then you put the every, but the everything but the bagel seasoning on it. So I grabbed these, I don't know, we'll see if they're good. I was bad. I picked up some candy. Haven't had these in forever. They're so yummy. Even when I was getting rung up by the lady, she's like, oh my gosh, these are the best gummies. I'm like, I know. I've been trying not to buy them, but I've grabbed them this time. And then I got one little red onion because I think we were gonna do fajitas at some point this week for dinner. And I already have the pepper, so I just needed the onion. So that's it. That's my little trader. So random. But I, I went for the cookies and flowers for my hair girl. So I got that plus some. 
it happens. Oh, and then you guys, the gas, the gas in the truck. That took me 20 minutes to get gas. We didn't do it over the weekend because Sam's Club on the weekend is just crazy. So I was like, I'll go first thing Monday morning thinking it would be slower. No, it took me 20 minutes to pump my gas. That's how crazy it is right now because our gas prices are so high. So everybody's going to Sam's Club to pump their gas. So 20 minutes to do that. Um, it is 4.85 at our Sam's Club and it still almost cost me a hundred dollars to fill up the truck and i still had a quarter of a tank left so it's nuts that's why sam's club is busy because people are saving that 15 20 cents it stinks but it is what it is hopefully we'll get some relief at the pump soon because they were high then they went down and now they're back up and sam's club i can tell they're back up because sam's club is crazy 20 minutes to get gas today all right let me put my groceries away and i think it's it's not even quite lunchtime. See, I didn't have my egg this morning and I'm hungry. The protein definitely helps you guys. Um, but I think I need lunch already. <laughs> He's that bad. Good morning, happy Tuesday. I'm about ready to head out for my hair appointment, but you guys, I am so disappointed in myself. Did you guys notice during my Trader Joe's haul yesterday? What was I missing? I did not get my sweet and spicy jalapenos at Trader Joe's. That's one of the reasons, well, this is the main reason I went, but that was the second reason. Oh, Ace, I know, I'm sorry, Betty. He knows I'm about ready to leave. Um, so yeah, I made my breakfast this morning. I was gonna do my avocado toast with egg and the jalapenos. And I'm like, <laughs> I forgot my jalapenos again. So I guess I'll have to go back to Trader Joe's again eventually, <laughs> that stinks. But time to go get this haircut. Um, it's a little crazy, I haven't washed it since the weekend, since summer's gonna wash it right now for me. But um, time to go get it my haircut. I'm sorry, A, he didn't not get a walk today. Oh, W-A-L-K, don't say that. I think that's what he thinks we're going right now, but I don't have time to take him today. I'm sorry, Ace. I'm sorry. You be a good boy while I'm gone, okay? Okay. Fresh hair, all done. I kept the length. She just took off what she needed to for the split ends. So trying to keep it long. Um, but of course, since I was in the area, you guys, I stopped at Aldi. I always do because it's in the area. They're supposed to be building one out by us, but I don't know, maybe they changed their mind because I've, I've heard that rumor for quite a while now and I have no idea because they haven't even broke ground if they are, but it's always fun to go to Aldi and grab stuff that, it's just different stuff, like this. Hopefully these are good. Protein shakes, Jack was all out, so he has a few to get him through the rest of the week so we can get back to Sam's Club, so hopefully those are good, but. And then random stuff, I thought Mason maybe would like these, kind of, Tastes like Thin Mints, maybe. But just some random stuff. I don't know, maybe I'll show you some fun things that I got. I think Mason likes when I go to Aldi because I'm just looking at everything. A lot of this stuff is for Mason. I get a lot of his like snacky foods from there. Um, I showed you the cookies. This is for me. <laughs> uh, Mason loves these. This is for Mason. He loves the birthday cake ones, so I saw these. Go grab those for him. Um, these are for Mason's fridge upstairs. Ranch is for us. Um, that might be a lunch for me. These look good. Mason, this is for me. I'm gonna make a wrap. I think I'm gonna actually do it for lunch right now. I'm so hungry. This look good. Just random stuff here, you guys. Some cheese, some feta cheese, because I'm gonna make a salad. Some more sour cream, maybe for dinner. This butter's pretty good. We've had it before. Um, more lunch ideas for me. Hopefully this is good. Um, Mason and salsa to go into my wrap with the chicken that I showed you right there. Um, got these for Mason. <laughs> Mason. 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 And then this is my stuff. <laughs> some raisin bran and some coffee. We tried their coffee. Last time we went, it's decent, not bad. So I think it was four something, so not bad price. And then Mason, he loves this. This is his favorite mac and cheese. There you go. So pretty much it's either for Mason or me for lunches. There's my little Aldi haul. <laughs> yep, that's yum. That's definitely gonna hit the spot. Considering it is one o'clock and I hadn't had lunch yet. That is so yummy. 
and the Aldi salsa is yum. FYI. On the day when the 76ers center Joel Embiid wins the MVP, another Philadelphia MVP is returning. That guy right there, Bryce Harper. I don't know how he did it. I don't know how he's back, but Bryce Harper is returning to the Phillies lineup like 159 days after uh, Tommy John surgery, after the playoff run last season, but he is back. I'm curbing expectations here a little bit. Hopefully he goes yard in his first day B just to get some excitement going in here. But uh, right now that is what we are doing, building some excitement and anticipation. As you can see, Ace is so excited he can't stay awake. Mm. Well, strike out in the first day B. Not the end of the world, but happy to have Harper back in the lineup. A lot of baseball left, a lot of season left, so we're excited to have number three back in the Phillies lineup here. Good morning, it is Wednesday. We're halfway through the week. So yesterday, you guys know, I got my hair cut. Today, it's Ace's turn. <laughs> About ready to take him off to the groomers. Oh, you excited, you wanna say hi? Okay, go ahead, say hi. Look, that's my before. I'm gonna be nice and clean and less hair in about four hours. So yeah, it's, it's Ace's turn to go to the groomer, so about ready to head out. You gonna be a good boy, right? You gonna be a good boy? <laughs> he loves going to the groomers. Um, I've talked about it before. They don't cage him up at this place that I take him. They let the dogs that are there getting their hair done um, all play together, so it's like, a fun day if you don't knock mom over. So yeah, he he looks, he knows what haircut means. He knows what that is, so better to head out. All right, look who's home. Drinking, he already drank his entire water bowl. Ace. <laughs> I was gonna show off your haircut. Ace, come here. Can you sit? Sit. You a handsome doodle. Look at that handsome dude. Oh, do you need to go? Oh, do you drink too fast? Now he's gonna have to go do his business. All the usual things when he comes home from his hair appointment. So he's home, waiting for Mason. He should be home from school soon. And then eventually I have to get dressed for the day because we have Mason's baseball banquet tonight. So probably should put some makeup on and look presentable for that. Um, but yeah. All right, buddy. You look handsome now. Yes, you do. Go potty. Go boy. A few hours later and look at us. We clean up. Sort of nice, <laughs> as good as it's gonna get. Jack B, Mason, all right, you ready? We don't, Jack, we only have two more of these. Mason, mm -hmm. two more. Yep. That's nuts. Oh, seems like he was just a freshman. We were going to our first one and we didn't know what to expect. He had his basketball one first. So sure. we went to two for basketball. We'll go for four for baseball. But here we go, junior year, baseball banquet. Have fun. Thanks, bro. <laughs> I think we're getting barbecue, I think, is what I was told. So we all so. dress nice just <laughs> well, yes. We all have dark colors on. That was smart. Kind of all kind of match. That's nice. Look at us. Look at us. It's like we knew, oh, that's loud. It's like we knew what we were doing. We're like color coordinated here. Yes. Sort of. Well, I got my flowy pants on. Mason last second decided to put shorts on because everybody's wearing shorts on the team. He's got his fancy shoes. Looking good. All right. We need to head out so that we're not late. Just like that, we were back from the banquet and it was barbecue, so I was right. And I brought my dessert home. Mm. Cupcake, bubble gum, but Mason, you wanna show? Sure. He got his varsity letter. Ta da da da! Congratulations, and then a pin. So I guess the thing to do is to get a, a varsity jacket, but. I don't know, is that like something that baseball players do or is that more like football players? Football. They did send out an email for all juniors if you want to start ordering your um, varsity jackets and class, um, class rings, which I had a class ring. I remember I had a volleyball on it. So yeah, I don't know. If Mason wants it, we will order it for him. So, But good job, Mace. Thank you. And the 76ers. Not a good job. Not, not a good job. We were, <laughs> it stinks that the game was on while we were at the, the banquet, but Jack was checking the score while we were at the then banquet. Then I stopped checking the score. Yeah, it, was, it, it, it wasn't a good game, so. All right, we're home. Ace, we're home. We weren't gone too long. All right, time to change into pajamas and go to bed. Hello, it is Thursday. This week is flying by. I just think that it's been busy with appointments, banquets, work, all the things. I can't believe it's Thursday already. 
but I'm about ready to head off to the Dollar Tree. First of all, you guys, I am on Dollar Tree TikTok. It keeps coming up in my For You page. Um, people are finding really good things at Dollar Tree, so I'm interested to see if our Dollar Tree has some of the stuff that I've been seeing. Probably not, because I feel like our Dollar Tree is not like everybody else's Dollar Tree. But the main reason I'm going is because we have birthdays to celebrate. So Bryce's birthday is coming up, let's see, on the five days. His birthday's in five, he'll be 16, you guys. And of course, Mason's birthday's coming up. We are actually going to celebrate them this weekend. So I need, that's the one thing my Dollar Tree does have, cheap uh, birthday cards or any type of cards. Um, wrapping paper, gift bags, like my Dollar Tree never fails me on that kind of stuff. So that's the main reason why I'm going. But I'm also gonna look around to see if maybe, I mean, people are finding like name brand makeup and stuff, like I'm curious. So I'm gonna head out to Dollar Tree. Hopefully I can find some good stuff. I'm home from the Dollar Tree. First off, you guys, our weather is beautiful. We're not even gonna hit 80 degrees, I think high of 78. And keep in mind over the weekend, it was 100 degrees, so oh, I'll take it. It's so beautiful outside. In fact, I just wanna go sit outside and enjoy the weather. Second of all, I just spent $32 at the Dollar Tree. <laughs> what? And I don't even think I got that great of things, but I did get wrapping paper. I did get a birthday card for Bryce. So the two things that I needed, I got, plus some other stuff. Um, some stuff I can't show you though because it's for Bryce's um, like little candies and snacks and stuff that I'll put inside of his um, birthday gift. But uh, I got some fun things maybe you guys wanna see. I don't know, let me show you. I got all of Bryce's stuff out besides the wrapping paper, but you guys can see the wrapping paper. Um, uh, <laughs> such random stuff. Okay, first of all, look how cute this is. I don't break it. How fun is this coffee mug? I've been wanting just a simple, clear coffee mug so I can feel fancy. $1.25, so I had to get that. Got Mason an IBC cream soda for when he comes home from school. So they sell pink drinks now bottled from Starbucks at the store. Add these in there and it's gonna be like the real thing over ice. So I got this for Mason. Found this for $1.25, that seemed like a good deal. Um, couldn't pass those up. It's little socks for when I wear my little like white shoes. They have donuts on it. A makeup sponge, and I think I got more makeup sponges, I think. Maybe not. A comb. <laughs> this probably is not gonna work, but for $1.25, I'll give it a try. These things are typically expensive. Um, I have really tight teeth, so I always have to get like the, the ones that are easier to use for your tight teeth, so we'll try. For $1.25, why not? We're gonna be doing some traveling this summer, so perfect size for shaving in the shower on our trips. I've never used these before. I don't even know if it's gonna work. We'll give it a try. Currently soaking our shower upstairs, so I'm gonna go up there right now and scrub away, and hopefully it's nice and shiny and white. I saw somebody pick one of these up in one of the TikToks. I think my sister has done this. I've never done this before, I'm a little nervous. We'll give it a try. Oh, I did get more makeup sponges. And a makeup brush. It's wet and wild, so not bad, not bad. These you put in your um, like sink and stuff when it starts to smell a little funky. I don't know, probably not gonna work, but I'll give it a try. I normally do like lemon and ice cubes down my garbage disposal. And I actually have been using a makeup uh, towel instead of like the makeup towels that are like wet. I used to get them at Sam's Club. That's how I used to take off my like eye makeup. I've been using this because I got it in my um, countdown calendar at Christmas time and it actually works. So we'll see if the Dollar Tree one works. And that's my Dollar Tree haul. Like I said, I have another little bag over there that has a lot of stuff for Bryce in it. So I don't wanna show that off in case he watches this vlog. But um, yeah, it was kind of fun going up and down all the aisles. So we'll see, we'll see if this stuff works or not. Friday, it's Cinco de Mayo. Happy Cinco de Mayo, happy weekend. I washed my hair today and didn't even get dressed for the day. I did put on a Phoenix Suns um, shirt because the Phoenix Suns play tonight, the Sixers play tonight. I'm pretty sure the Phillies play, the Dimebacks. Oh, the Sixers are running, yeah. Everybody plays. Hey Mace. Yo. Are you out of here? Yeah, I'm gonna throw. Um, so, 
yeah, I'm like, I'm not going anywhere. Why waste the money on makeup if I'm literally going to just sit on the couch all night and watch the Phoenix Suns? We have to win. Mace, are they gonna do it? I hope so. Oh, I hope so. What are the Sixers? Are they one and one? It's one and one, but Suns are down Suns two. Suns are down two, so yeah. Suns need to I win tonight, but Mason's about ready to head out. He's going to baseball. Not official practice. He's just going with his friends. They're gonna throw. In fact, we, oh my gosh, I was just looking at our schedule coming up. <laughs> Stay tuned. Um, he definitely needs to get his arm going again and all the things because we are going to be like crazy, crazy go, go, go this summer. So stay tuned for all that. But on that note, it is Friday. We're gonna end the vlog. We practice hard, or practice, I don't know, what do I say? Have fun. Have fun. Bad lighting, hold on. There's better lighting. Okay, have fun practicing. And we're gonna go down the vlog. So don't forget to like this video, comment something in the comment section, subscribe. As always, thanks for watching. We will see you next, next time. Sorry, the lighting's bad. Later, everyone. Bye.